Red Dead Redemption 2 is finally out, and it's my personal game of the year already. Regardless, if Hitman 2 ends up being an even better game, when my grandfather and I would whittle shotguns out of twigs on his stoop, our collective minds would wander into the dark ages of the United States, known as the Wild West. To no surprise, Red Dead fulfills my fantasy of gunslinging, hijacking trains, and robbing people that I deem to be bad. There were a few things I wish Rockstar would have made more clear when I first started this game. Luckily for you, I've spent an entire five minutes putting together some tips that may help future outlaws rule these forsaken lands. Number one. And if you find the game to be too gunful. slow, you can go to any town with your trusty sawed-off shotguns and pluck the life away from anyone you want. This turns the town into a fun and chaotic shooting gallery. Number two. When you sit down to play dominoes, you may realize this is not the dominoes you remembered growing up. You know, the one where you can knock over several other dominoes with the flick of one domino. Luckily, you can get up and leave by holding down the circle button or B button on Xbox. You can't just leave in the middle of a round. Number three. When someone is begging for help on the side of the road, it's rude to rope them and drag them to the nearest shelter. This seems to kill them and cause the town to turn into a shooting gallery yet again. Number four. You cannot rope trains. Number five. If you're in your inventory, you can switch out your shotguns to guns that actually have a range longer than five feet in front of you. Number six. If you're surrounded by filthy lawmen, Dynamite does the trick. Has a better blast radius than the shotgun. Number seven. Sometimes you get a little dirty and it's time to take a bath. Relax. Paying for a premium bath is not a wise use of your money, as the whore doesn't even bring you better shampoos. Number eight. In Grand Theft Auto Online, one of my favorite online experiences, flying cars are an option and one I use extensively. Hoping they'd continue this tradition in Red Dead Redemption 2, I decided to see if my horse could fly by leaping off a nearby cliff. Uh, sadly, my ball of speed was unable to fly. Number 9. My shotguns typically don't have a lot of ammo storage, so to conserve my precious ammunition, you can usually bring a knife to a gunfight and win. Sometimes not. Number 10. If you're ever too high up in the mountains and want to go fishing and in the rivers below, it's a long hike to the bottom, especially if you just try to fly your horse off the side of a cliff. Luckily, I discovered a shortcut that cuts minutes off your playtime. If you dive into the river and avoid the rocks below, you can swim to shore and catch that fast bass before you can say shotgun.